everyone. We're so excited Techni Summit Alexandria is finally here again. To ensure that you have a pleasant and swift experience, here is a step-by-step -step video to help you complete your ticket, access our application and all its features. After you book your pass, you will receive an email with the title, Your Techni Summit Alexandria 2022 Confirmation. If you scroll down, you will find a blue button with the words view order written on it. Press on it and open a browser. This will take you to a page where your ticket is. However, you have to complete your ticket and answer some questions in order for your ticket to be valid. So press assign your tickets. This will take you to a page with a couple of questions, some basic information like your company name, first name, last name, email and phone number, and some additional information. And this section has some questions that are required, like age range, for example, and it has some other questions that are not required, like amount of funding needed, for example. So please answer all the required questions, and also please answer all of the questions that are relevant to you, even if they're not required, because this will help make your experience even more personalized on our app. I took a couple of minutes to answer all the required questions and all the relevant questions to me, even if they weren't required. And now I'm going to scroll down to the very bottom and I'm going to press save. All done. Great. Now your ticket is complete. If you scroll down again, you will find your ticket at the bottom and if you press view slash edit ticket here is your ticket on the top you will find the type of pass you have in my case it's a business pass and right under you will find the order reference or the booking reference and the QR code for your ticket and you will need your booking reference and your QR code to register for the event and take your ID and to sign in to our app. Now that your ticket is complete, you are ready to download the app and sign in. So the next step now is to visit the Play Store, the App Store, depending on what phone you have. So I'm going to visit the Play Store and I'm going to search for the Techni app. So I visited the Play Store and I've searched for the Techni Summit app and here it is. And now I'm going to install it. Now that the app is installed, you can sign up using your ticket ID. So you can go to your email and you'll find the ticket called your Techni Summit Alexandria 2022 ticket. If you scroll down, you will find your ticket and on the top right, you will find your ticket ID. So I'm going to copy and paste the ticket ID to the app. Here you have two options. You can either scan the QR code on your ticket from your laptop or another device, or you could enter the ticket ID. So I'm going to enter the ticket ID that I just copied from my ticket. And I'm going to press enter. Now I have to create a password. When you're creating your password, make sure it's a strong password with both capital and small letters and make sure it has numbers and symbols as well. I created a strong password and now I'm ready to submit it. You have now successfully logged into our application. Let me walk you through it. First of all, on the top left, you will find a circle in which you can insert your picture, your name and your pass type. To edit your profile and to add your picture, click on the circle on the top left. Then click on the settings icon on the top right. Then click on edit profile. Here you can add a picture, you could edit your name, email, and you can even add an about section about you. After you're done editing, you can press save and update. Also, make sure that the push notifications button is always on so you get notified with all the updates and if someone messages you. 
After you're done editing your profile, adding your picture and your bio, and making sure that the push notifications button is on, you could go back to the main screen. Under your name and ticket type, you will find your QR code, booking reference or ticket ID. And you could use this QR code at the registration desk at the event so you could take your name ID or name badge. Under the QR code, you'll find some sessions that are recommended just for you based on your preference. And you could click on any session to view more details about it. When you click on any session, it will tell you which track it's on. For example, this session is in Startup Business Academy track. And you will also find the speakers in this session and the date and the time and the location and then a brief description about it. And if you like this session, you could easily add it to your agenda through the button at the bottom. Okay, let's go back again to the main page. If you scroll down in the app, you will also find our speakers and our investors. And if you scroll down more, you will find our sponsors. At the bottom, you will find a couple of different buttons in which you could use. For example, you'll find the For You button. If you press on it, you'll find sessions that are recommended for you. You could also press on the agenda. And for me, I would like to see the agenda of the first day. So I'm going to press on the filters and scroll down and choose day one and make sure that I have the full time range and apply. Now I'll be able to view the agenda of the whole day and I could add anything to my own personal agenda just by pressing the blue button on the right. Okay, let's go back. Now I have the Techni agenda and now I have my own personal agenda. And if I filter with day one, I'll find the sessions that I put in my agenda on that day. At the bottom, you will also find directory. And this is where you could view all the attendees in the conference, all the speakers, all the investors and executives, all the media representatives, and even all the exhibitors. Last but not least, on the bottom right, you'll find your messages. Make sure to reach out to other attendees in the conference and network with them. You could network with anyone who has the same pass as you do or lower. And this is all you need to know about the app for now. There are so many other features, so make sure to do some exploring on your own and make sure to reach out to us if you have any questions. Have a lovely and productive summit.